today I'm going to use these little bits and pieces over here to assemble an undead army that does my bidding. We just need to make sure all the pieces are in place and then we can revive a skeleton. That will just go out into the field and collect more stuff for us, like some more body parts and some resources. And the whole while he's just going to be attacking things that come his way. And you can also use some more friends. So we'll go ahead and use, this one has a wizard's cape on him. And so we'll match that with a hat and a wizard and some feet like this. And I have a skeleton mage with two wands. So he should go out and do things. Whoa, okay, enemies on the field. Thankfully, my wizard is more than equipped to take them out. Excellent. Destroy them all. Yes, and look at all that gold they're leaving behind. It's perfect. And with even more parts, we'll go ahead and use the regular legs this time. And woo, a new day with a lot more bits to it as well. Oh, an enemy layer is here. And our wizard is just over there already to take it out. That is excellent. Good job, little friend. But there's a lot of enemies coming after him so run away he's doing a good job and i don't even have to control him but i can actually control them as well if i really want to so he can come over here and explore a little bit of the map down this way to hopefully find something new Ooh, a blueprint an optics laboratory which will improve their vision and thankfully i have enough resources for that so we'll go ahead and do it and now the discovery window is much bigger but there's also this little thingy over here that i would like to investigate so now it's a little observatory it seems to be doing something for us uh oh there's enemies flying towards the castle faster than my skeletons can run thankfully the archer's right there and the enemies just focus on the skeletons rather than my castle excellent Excellent. My skeleton took a little bit of damage, but that's okay. I'll let him do some more exploring on his own. Ooh, and they discovered a mine that's giving us some iron resources as well. That's excellent. And there's a gold mine over there. Ooh, so many things to capture. Like another observatory. I'm not really sure what these do. Maybe they... Oh, wait, it says, removes the fog of war in a small radius. Awesome. And this one will bring in some mana every morning. Yes, because that's what's used to revive things. Oh, now we can make a bronze forge. That will give some armor to our dead. So with just one more piece of iron, we can make that. And now we have more zombie parts that we can use as well. I love like it so we'll put a zombie head on there and a chest and this is a tower shield looking thing we'll go ahead and give you that one as well as a sword with armor and sword and then we'll give you some legs to go with it and now we revive Ooh, a recipe a zombie mutant what and i was right that is a tower shield look at his arm though he's been hitting arm day on just the one side and now because it's a blueprint we can make him whenever we have all the parts for it excellent and look at him he's ready to go out and do the work there must be one for a skeleton wizard so let's get those pieces together with the legs like this and a a wand and I could give him a zombie arm but that won't give a recipe oh a relic gives all the dead five vision bonus very cool uh oh tower's under attack how'd that guy get to the tower well that's just rude of you sir I need to get another minion out into the field hey skeleton mage support that's a cool little blueprint and he should be able to go right away and help defend the castle yes and now they're not focused on me anymore all right we have a few more pieces that's an orc skeleton leg what uh oh I'm thinking about this too much I need more minions just get all the skeletons out into the field that I can with some boots because these boots are made for walking. Get out there and cut them down. Yes, excellent. Oh, uh, they tore down my skeleton that I camped up there. Well, in any case, we need more minions in the field, so let's go ahead and get some pieces together. I want to see these orc skeleton legs do some work, but right now I don't have enough mana, so let's go ahead and burn some parts that we're not using. We have a lot of skeleton torsos and a lot of skeleton legs. Let's just go ahead and burn one of those. Now we can bring him out here and his legs are looking chunky. Go out and do the work. Uh-oh, that's a lot of wolves too carrying through. That's just mean of you. And what is this? A jellyfish tentacle. I want to see that. Is there anything weird that we can put on him? Well, here's a shield. That should be good for him. And some zombie legs with boots. Now, he needs a chest, so we'll just give him the skeleton one. But right now, we have no one defending the castle right now, so this is hurting quite a bit. Please revive and do... Whoa! <laughs> What in the world? There's a massive Cthulhu thing happening out of nowhere. Please get rid of the enemies. They're getting a little hurty. And I'll control you just so I can manage things better. And also just stay away from my castle. All of you. And attack all of them at once. Oh, those tentacles are so good. And I have another one. Let's go ahead and make a zombie mage with it. And a dagger as well, so there's constant attack. And now he needs some legs, so we give him some legs. Hopefully there's enough mana to revive someone. Yes, there is. So more tentacles can destroy everything. 
I love it. Our castle is taking quite a bit of damage, but we're holding out pretty well. And something's gonna happen in six minutes. I have no idea what it is, but I'm a little worried about it. We need to take out one of the enemy bases so they just stop invading like they are doing. There's also whatever that guy is. Is that a king? I'm not sure, but he has a lot of hit points. So our guys are gonna need a little bit of support. Let's give this skeleton two swords and the armor chest that we didn't before so we can have just a lot more attacks happening. There, that should be working. Oh, they're actually dealing a lot of damage to the castle. My skeleton did not last very long. We're being ripped apart. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Don't push him into the castle. You're supposed to lead them away and then attack him. There you go. Uh oh, that guy's making his way. Oh, he deals so much damage. No, stop it. You want to take apart my skeleton? Quick, attack him. Attack him. Yeah. Now keep him away. I said keep him away. Please keep them away from my castle. It's so weak right now. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Not good. Not good. No, we got defeated. Well, that's okay because we can upgrade some things in our keep here. Like in a little resource collecting cat. Sure. So now we can release a cat to collect resources. Go ahead and do that. Yeah, look at him go. Now my minions won't have to worry about collecting them themselves. I like it. And we have the blueprints that we can use this time. Let's go ahead and scrap everything together based on what the zombie or skeleton mage can do. And let's try to keep our mana production high because that's the most important resource for us right now. And also finding more recipes. So let's see, skeleton head, chest, a regular arm, a regular shield. I need some regular legs because I feel like the boots throw it off. And I could be wrong, but I think the cat reveals the map. That's handy. And there's one skeleton leg. Now we just need another one. And our mage is really getting busy at tearing apart that base right there. And now we can send out the cat again to collect all these little bits and baubles. Please let there be a normal leg in there. Oh, the cat captured the mine all on his own. Excellent. Hey, the new day gave us a leg. So hopefully this is something. Yes, a bone warrior. Just in time too. Enemies started flooding our base. Okay, we'll take a break from finding recipes. I need to get more units into the field. So let's go ahead and give you a sword and a crossbow. That should be good to use. And I can actually give the next one two crossbows, which should be fine. Oh, a fertilizer hall. Increase the regeneration of your dead. Interesting. Well, I can make it, so why not? And I feel like the armored pieces will work together to create something new. So let's give you an armored shield over here, a uh, thing over here, and some boots, because why not? And an armored chest, okay. And hiya. Hey, a skeleton guardian. We're finding a whole lot of recipes. And take out the flies, please. No, the flies damaged my base. Why would you let them do that? Okay, so the armor is good. And let's just slap some blueprints together, like another guardian. And we'll give you a zombie head, because why not? And there's more enemies coming in right away, because of course there are. And I can barely scrap enough to make it worth it. Now, I need places that give me mana generation. And I also need them to take out the enemy bases so they stop attacking me. And I'm also controlling the zombie just so the flies can stop going towards my castle. Pull them away. Pull them all away. Oh, there's more flies. Nasty. Just stay away from it. It's fine to my minions take a little bit of damage because they'll be good about it. And I can send out the cat again. Need to remember to do that. Ooh, some crypts. Ooh, zombie body parts. Yes, that's the good stuff right there. Now we need some harder hitting minions. So let's strap together a zombie if we can with all of these bits and we can revive him. Yes. Oh, that arm is so grotesque. And we can throw together a bone warrior very quickly just so we get more units out in the field. And what is this one? A zombie head with a helmet. That is an impressive helmet. And let's also create a zombie mutant. And we'll give him the dagger over there. We just need a little more mana. Perfect. But this one is not a mutant. That's okay. Oh gosh, more enemies coming from the north. Thankfully, my minions are moving that way. But hopefully, my minions will be enough to take out that base right there. Even though this one is having a hard time with that whatever it is after him. Although I have five minions over there, so they should be enough. Uh-oh, there's more things coming in. Uh, quickly. Zombie mutant and give him a magic wand because I don't care. Lead them away from the castle. Orc skeleton. I really need to put one of these together. But also, I really can't be picky right now, so we just need to get things out into the field. I just need bits, and I'm having to burn bits to make bits, which hurts. But also, look at how much damage they're doing to my castle. Ah! Please get out there and defend. Lead them away. And there's peasants with sticks that are on fire trying to burn me. Actually, no, those are flags. Pretty much just slapping things together and hoping that they work. But they're also really expensive. I need my minions to come back to the castle. Where are they? What are you doing over there? Come back. They destroyed the base, which is good, but it doesn't matter if my tower collapses. Oh, there's a tentacle thing right there. I need it. Release it. Attack them all. Yes. There we go. And then the orc that I'm controlling will come in and help take them out. Yes. Okay, that worked. Collect all this mana. Oh, no. That's a big army of peasants. Yes. 
Follow the zombie. Follow the zombie. He will lead you to the promised land while his tentacle armed buddy will show up and just decimate you. Yes. There's a little bit of regeneration, but it's not much. I could upgrade it again. I might need to just so my allies can heal. And I also need to collect all these little mana bits right here and craft more baddies and release again. Once again, ooh, that, that looks fun. Just need a little more mana. Revive. Yeah, do it. I don't even know what that does. Oh, he's throwing out little uh, axe things. Look at all of those danger markers. This is not good. This is very not good. Let's see if I can throw together an orc really quickly. I have enough of those things. I have an arm here, but it's armored. That's fine. And what are you? Oh, you're so expensive. I have absolutely no mana to use as well. Send out the kitty. And you need to just stand still so they can be attracted to you. This is getting very worrisome. <laughs> what was that thing? What are you? Hold on. <laughs> It was such a bulk to your chest and nothing else. That's hilarious. My castle's getting ripped apart, but oh man, that was that was just funny. I think I'll let this one go ahead and be destroyed. And then I can get a Tesla machine to smite enemies with a lightning spell. Oh, that sounds good. The goal is to last the 15 minutes that it gives me. So we can send out the kitty right away to give us some free resources without spending body parts. And we already almost have enough for a bone warrior. Hopefully he can find one more leg. But the blueprints are good for getting most of the things constructed. And and you, I need to stop by these graves and pick up more body parts. There we go. Just another grave over here. And they're both attacking that lair, which is good. And now if we get just a little more metal, we can increase the damage of our dead. And also control one of you to stop by down here and collect this mana spot. Because for sure, I need mana regeneration. There we go. One level to that. And that's the only level, I guess. Ooh, Hall of Bones gives plus four to skeleton growth. I like the sound of that. If only I had a little more metal. Let's just print up a skeleton guardian and then send you to control all these mines over here as soon as the enemies get taken out. Defend the castle first and foremost. Although, let's try this lightning spell out that I can target you. Aha! Very nice damage. So quickly, come over here, discover this mine. Very good. And then come over here, discover this mana well, and take out some flies while you're at it. And I think the bone warriors are good, cheap material to just go out and collect things when I don't have the kitty. Speaking of the kitty, go kitty! Collect all the things! Ooh, a goblin workshop. Tower repair? I like the sound of that. I'll just need a little more metal. And I love the attack of that zombie mutant. It just goes wha bam and then things die. I wonder if there's a blueprint with this jellyfish tentacle. I would really like to see that. But I also want to make sure I get some actual blueprints in here. And so this should be something. All the pieces are armored except for the legs. Yeah, dead soldier. You look like you're gonna do some good work. And we'll also get some work going with the tentacle here, even though it's super expensive. I could probably scrap some of these smaller parts and just wait for the mana to fill in the rest of the spots. Ooh, a keychain. Increases the damage of the lightning spell? Wow, that's handy. I just hope that they're actually going to and destroying the layers like they are over here. That's good. Just keep attacking it. Very good. That's just a basic bone warrior too. I'm proud of you. Okay, now we have some actual orc parts that we can throw together. I would like to see a blueprint of these. Ooh, Plague Doctor Jar. There's an Acid Cloud spell I can get? Oh, I need to check that out. Now let's just try it again. an Orc Skeleton together. I need an arm. An unarmored one, preferably. But I don't have time for that. Enemies are here. Oh my gosh, Orcs are expensive. Quickly scrap parts and then ha, send him out there. Send him. He should be really tanky too because he's big and big things mean tanky. Wow. <laughs> he took them all out in one swing. Do it again. I'll help you out if I need to. Maybe I'll do that just because they're right next to the castle. Oh, okay, that's very handy. Oh, that Orc is doing so good. I like you. Let's get more of these together, even though they're super expensive. Now we're getting some really dangerous allies in the field. Although I also need you to stay still because there's more enemies coming in. Okay, yeah, you attack the wolves and then he'll attack whatever's over here. Some more wolves. I think that one might be at a bit of a loss because all he does is throw axes in four directions. Whoa, a portal. What? I can, what does that do? To activate this portal, draw a rune inside a silhouette. Okay, I play Mario Party a few times. I can do a stencil work. The portal has been activated. Now you can use it to release the dead. Oh, very cool. But right now, though, I need them around the castle because that's where the enemies are. So now I can send skeletons all the way to that portal, wherever it was. That's handy. But there's also immediate danger that I'm more worried about. Just need to make sure I get some pieces in the field, like really defensive pieces. Okay, now we have some unarmored orc parts. That's good for making a blueprint. I just need one more. Let's do you. But you're also expensive. Clear out some real estate. There we go. Revive. Aha! A skeleton orc cutthroat with some reduced cooldown, too. Ooh. Hurry and defend the castle. I have some more parts coming in. That's good. Some armored parts. That's good. Kind of. Not those. I need these ones. And then one more armored part. Yes. Clear out some real estate. Revive. A skeleton or cannibal. Wait, a cannibal? Why would you even cannibalize? You don't have meat on your bones. 
Whatever. Defend. I love the orc army I'm creating, and I have a lot of minions in the field, too. Oh, no way. I have two tentacles here. Who do I give it to? A, a zombie? What do I have a head for? A skeleton. Maybe I'll just give him the orc body as well. Oh, that's the funniest thing I've ever seen. <laughs> I know you'll do me proud. I just will laugh at you the entire time you do it. Destroy these dogs. Destroy them really good. Maybe I'll attack them for you. Or these peasants. Hiya! Some nice damage to the peasants too. Oh, what are you? A harpy with some vampire arms? And okay, it's time to just finagle some things together just because I want to see this. Oh, 90 mana for that? Scrap some things and send them out there. <laughs> that, that, that is just ridiculous. Release it. Ooh, vampire arms do some dirty work there. Just some nice little swarms of bats. Hey, oh, that's the thing the guy talking about. The blueprint for the foundation. How do I use you? Oh, I can use you right now. Do it. Hey, that's a promising structure right there. Very nice. <laughs> and there's just swarms of bats flying everywhere. Oh, that is amazing. And I have a vampire body too. Although the things I have the most are the harpy parts. So maybe I can get one of those together. It looks so weird. Harpies are some of the, like the weirdest things ever imagined. I am not gonna lie. Although the vampire arms do some good. Let's just give you a tentacle as well. Revive. And we'll send you, we'll send you to the portal just so you can do some more exploring out there. Oh, no way. A box of joys. Hmm, that seems familiar. Increase the speed of a controlled dead. Now let's get something to defend the castle right away. Uh oh, I sent it through the portal. Oh no. Ah, quick blueprint. Create and arm, arm and a chest. Where's the chest? Chest. Revive. I can't revive more than 15 dead? What do you mean? My castle's getting ripped apart. You're gonna tell me what I can't do? There's no one close enough. Oh, how dare the game do me like that. But we did get the foundation for the return project. And so now he's talking about needing supports like scaffolding. And the good news is we also have enough coins to get the necromancer's table, which produces some bones every morning. <laughs> it's just a hand in a pot. Ah, oh, that's cute. Love to see that. Maybe it'll scratch my back for me. But anyway, guys, I'll leave this video here. Hope you guys enjoy Necrosmith. If if you did and you want to see more, then be sure to let me know. Thank you very much for watching and sub to intern. And I'd also like to thank the channel members, including Bread, Mr. Cripple One, Ancient Elixir One, Corby Farm, Dakota C, Donamoto, Devion X, Muffin Suffer, Lucas S, Ali B, Splattersax, The Real Nickname, Edward, Hateful Herald, Todd M, Peggy Sue O, and Droopalong.